All right, today on On The Ropes, I'm up here, up there with young Jaleel Hackett. What's good? How you doing, Sam? How you doing, Sam? Man, talk about the experience this time around in camp so far. Man, this whole camp, just, it was great. You know, the way he was looking the whole camp, just was, he, he was, I ain't going to say he, he was just on a different level, but he was, this, this tank right here versus the tank from last camp, it will be a no contest. He, he really looking that dominant. Now, with that being said, what's your prediction on the, on the fight December 28th? Tank and eight. The reason why I'm saying eight is because a lot of this camp, he been, he been, he been mixing it up. He, he ain't been just walking you down. He been mixing it up. He might walk sometimes, but he been, he been moving. I think he's going to make a run into something, and it's going to be like a devastating. I know it's, it's, I know it's the end of the year, but it's going to be a knockout of the year type knockout. Now, Last knockout of the year might be a knockout of the year type knockout. Oh, that's what's up, that's man. That's what I'm saying. You know, I got to ask you, man, from your first time around in camp to this time around in camp, what have you learned from that experience um, taking it into this time in camp? Um, I can say, honestly, I, every time I come into camp with him, I feel like I leave with something. I always leave with a different a different move, or a different piece to, a piece to, my, to my, my whole puzzle. So I feel like last camp it was. I feel like it made me. First, last camp was like shopping me up a little bit. It woke me up to the difference between amateurs and pros. This camp I feel like I picked up like the the, the speed and the timing of the pro game a little bit. I ain't saying I picked up 100 percent because at the end of the day you got to step in there with no head gear and eight ounce gloves to kind of catch that timing a little bit. But I feel like I always lead. I always lead the camp with a skill. You know, I was going to ask you about that because one of the things that you talked about the last time around in camp, the first time around, was the speed of the pro level and how you had to adjust to that. Yeah. So you had that time over over a couple of months to, to really adjust prepare, to, yeah, yeah, to adjust to it. Now it's, it's a little different spawn with amateurs. It's like me spawn with amateurs is everything is way fast. I'm zip, 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 zip. It looked like they're moving in slow motion. So, yeah, I learned a lot here. Now, man, talk about Chicago and that whole experience. Oh, it was nice, man. It was real nice. Uh, oh, once again, I want to shout out Martel Griffin for letting us use his gym for the open workout. It was nice. You know, um, it was on Halloween night, and kids liked it. They were dressed up in their little costume. They was like, man, we ain't standing in no gym tonight. We got to go get some candy. <laughs> man, I was looking at them kids like, well, good luck, because it was snowing out there. It was cold. I was like, go ahead, go get your candy, but it's cold out there. <laughs> yeah, it was it nice experience yeah um love to go back it now was, now for those that don't know man this is your senior year of high school graduating early man what's yeah. the last your last year like so far it's been going good everybody they, they're proud of me everybody that like i've been on this road what since ninth grade they real proud of me they they want to see me take that next step so yeah just finish it strong. Yeah, just thinking about that, man. Do you have like a tentative date of when you're gonna be uh, debuting as a pro, as a professional? It's looking like May. Looking like May. Yes. Okay, that's what's up, man. Hey, man, you getting bigger and stronger too, man. Yeah. I think what you benching now, like two thirty. Nah, I'm at two twenty five consistently. Two twenty five is consistent. Okay. I've hit two thirty before, but two twenty five is the most consistent. And uh, you plan on coming in at what weight? One forty. Woo! Well, one forty on notice right now, man. That's a hot division too, man. Oh, no, definitely. Now you got the Josh Taylors of the world, Regis, uh, Malik. <laughs> so yeah, it's, it's, that's that's a nice stack division right there, man. Yeah. But I know you're gonna do big things, man. Coming out of DC, and I see you got something major that do coming. Major, man. It's, hey, it's, it's said and done. It'll be here in a couple of weeks, y'all. That's what's up, man. I really appreciate your time on the ropes, man. No, definitely. All the time, Zach. All right, we out.